Okay, so as you can see, we have a regular R2 unit, but what I've done is I've added a camera to the unit. So it's inside the head, and to power it up, I've got a USB cable. I opted to make it easier to charge instead of trying to embed it. I have a USB cable, it's on a little Velcro cap. I have a battery with rare earth magnets that just sticks right in place. Turn the battery on. I can plug it in. And now, got a regular droid that's got a uh, wireless camera built in. It's Wi Fi, it's got sound, you can talk and listen. And you can actually log into it. One of the challenges is to get the power to transfer up to the head, and since the head moves, the cable um, has to go up into the same position as the existing cable that's there. That way they'll both rotate together. You don't want to go to the far outside of the head and penetrate because the head's got to move and you'll end up uh, just binding up on the cable. So here's what it looks like. I've got the control. And I can sort of maneuver my way around now, and I've got a uh, droid view. Let's go. You can see uh, I've got a stormtrooper over there. That's Drew. But that's it. That's uh, how you put a. Uh, and it's, it happens to be a Wyze cam, W-Y-Z-E. I broke it apart into three pieces and laid the boards up inside the head. It's not a lot of room in the R2 dome, so you've got to be careful about how you lay them out, but uh, it can be done.